Does anybody in the audience that want to get a, take a shot at actually coming up here and saying something? Your mom? All right. Let's give it up for her.
to hang these precious and priceless collection of ornaments and garland that money can buy in the tallest tree, singing their merry songs, all the smiles, women and children dance, men brim as the ornaments honorably hang in their screaming, deafening silence. Tis the season to take pictures and postcards to be passed around and mailed around the world so that the past traditions will be celebrated and participated and never, never forgotten so wonky young boys can grow to be strong men in the community. And the wives and young girls will always make preparations for the hunt, the split logs, the roaring fire to pray to them in the shadowy crisp breeze that comes around this time of year. Tis the season. Remember? I saw you as I walked in sitting at the table. All kinds of smells and flavors was in the air. It was hard, it was hard not to take it all in with my nose and my eyes. And something caught my eye and I couldn't believe my eye. You was just sitting there, eating and eating and feeding and gorging yourself with such a small frame, I strained myself to see how you were taking it all in. I knew it wouldn't be long that all that you consumed come spewing out of your mouth. Are we getting smarter? Are our culture, are our kids getting smarter? Seems like we're only taught to study and pass the test. But the test is to never, never stop discovering. Education for Living. Let's count up the righteous, make us a list. Spit in the wind and it comes back. I turn my back on you and words fly in my mouth at the speed of sound. Pull back the curtain. This world, this is the world that you created. Creating thoughts and phrases that make you cringe. Kyle is sneaking by, pointing your finger at me. You hate my guts because I decide to pull back the curtain. Where do you go after you make your speeches? Who's in control? Where do you go after your speeches? Who's in control? You're controlled by someone, even the one that brings the world news and events, audition and read scripts. But when the news is off the cuff, there's a fish to cup. Pull back the curtain. So while you're out there doing your dirt smug, sweeping it under the rug, turning your back on your wife that's flirting, I'll be there, we'll be there, in the recesses, pulling back the curtain. Thank you. I was born a statistic. A ransom was put on my head at birth. Three major operations by the age of 19. The odds were against me since day one. I slipped through death scripts many times. Didn't even think I would make it past high school. I was told I wouldn't make it at 21. People around me didn't realize I put everybody around me in danger. Stayed up late nights, fearing I would take my last breath while I slumbered. As the sunlight hit my eyes, I woke up next to my wife and unborn child, getting prepared for my first day in my new career. I am 33 years old. I was born a statistic. Thank you. And I do want to thank everybody for supporting it. And, and the crowd is getting bigger, and we got people coming from all over. And we really want to thank you guys for helping us put this on. So I want to ask y'all to give y'all a hand, because if it wasn't for the many readers and fans and stuff like that, we wouldn't have a Literary Lounge Cafe, or we wouldn't have anywhere for us to voice ourselves because number one, it's, it's hard to get up here. I got a lot of people that tried it and they don't even get up here anymore, but it's hard to do that. Especially when you hear stuff like so many Americans are functional illiterate that for somebody to write and then bring it to the audience is a big deal. So we want to thank you guys for actually loving what we do. So give yourselves a hand right now.